Welcome to Review Central. This is Astet Reviewer Number 1, featuring questions for the Astet Mental Ability Subtest. This reviewer is intended for those who are eyeing, or are set to take, the USD Entrance Test, or Astet. There are 10 questions featured on this reviewer. All questions are modeled on actual questions that appeared on previous Astets. Before we proceed, don't forget to subscribe to Review Central and click or press the bell button to make sure you get notified whenever we post a new reviewer or other review materials on this channel. Let's begin. Question number one. The sum of the reciprocal of a number and 12 is 26. What is the number? A, one. B, one over six. C, 14. D, one over 14. E, five over 12. The correct answer is D, 1 over 14. Let X equals the number. The sum of the reciprocal of a number and 12 is 26. We write this in equation form as 12 plus 1 over X equals 26. Now we can solve for X. We should arrive at 1 over 14 as the answer. Question number 2. Jury is to deliberate in the same manner that lobbyist is to blank. A. Deprecate. B. Preside. C. Illuminate. D. Inform. E. Persuade. The correct answer is E. Persuade. A jury is a body of people that deliberate or engage in long and careful consideration of facts before arriving at a decision. A lobbyist pertains to a person who attempts to influence or persuade legislators. Question number 3. Identify the mistake in the sequence. 3, 4, 6, 8, 9, 10, 12, 16, 15. A, 8. B, 9. C, 10. D, 12. E, 15. The correct answer is C. The mistake in the sequence is the number 10. There are actually two alternating sequences. The first sequence, 3, 6, 9, 12, and 15, is an arithmetic sequence where 3 is added to each term to come up with the next. The second sequence, 4, 8, 10, and 16, is another arithmetic sequence where 4 is added to each term to come up with the next. This is where the mistake in the sequence is. The mistake in the sequence is the number 10. It should be 12. Therefore, the correct sequence should be 3, 4, 6, 8, 9, 12, 12, 16, 15. Question number 4. The jumbled words below can form a complete and grammatically correct sentence. 4. Take, never, granted, anyone. In which letter does the fifth word begin? A, letter A. B, letter G. C, letter N. D, letter F. E, letter T. The correct answer is B. The fifth word begins with the letter G. From the jumbled words above, the grammatically correct sentence is. Never take anyone for granted. The fifth word is granted which begins with the letter G. Question number 5. Given the following statements, as follows, Statement number 1, some dogs are gentle. Statement number 2, some cats are gentle. Statement number 3, therefore, some dogs are cats. Disregarding commonly known facts, which of the following can be said about the given conclusion? A. True. B. False. C. Cannot be certain. The correct answer is C. Cannot be certain. The given statements and their relationships and or interactions can be represented in a Venn diagram as shown. You may press the pause button and take time to study the Venn diagram. Based on the generated Venn diagram as shown, the conclusion that some dogs are cats cannot be certain. Take note that many logical reasoning problems, particularly syllogisms, are answered with the help of Venn diagrams. 
Although it is possible to solve syllogisms without using Venn diagrams, using Venn diagrams can be the easiest, fastest and most consistent way to solve syllogisms. Therefore, it is highly recommended that you learn how to use Venn diagrams. Check out the suggested link in the description for a video tutorial to quickly learn the basics of using Venn diagrams in solving logical reasoning problems. Question number 6. Which of the following figures is the odd one? The correct answer is A. This figure has four overlapping shapes. All the other figures have only three. Question number 7. How many possible outcomes are there in tossing three coins? A. 3 B. 6 C. 8 D. 9 E. 12 The correct answer is C. When three coins are tossed simultaneously the possible outcomes are the following. 1. Head 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 2. Head head tail 3. Head tail head 4. Head tail tail, 5. Tail head head, 6. Tail head tail, 7. Tail tail head, 8. Tail tail tail. Therefore, the number of outcomes for tossing three coins is 8. Formula wise, the number of possible outcomes is equal to 2 raised to 3, which is, of course, also equal to 8. Question number 8. Sam walks 8 meters north, 2 meters east, 2 meters north, 9 meters west, 10 meters south. How far is Sam from his starting point? A. 2 meters B. 5 meters C. 7 meters D. 9 meters E. 11 meters The correct answer is C. 7 meters. This is a physics problem featuring scalars and vectors. First, let's add all the x, or west to east distances, denoting eastward and westward as positive and negative x distances, respectively. We should arrive at minus 7. Next, let's add all the y or south to north distances, denoting northward and southward as positive and negative y distances, respectively. We should arrive at 0 as the answer. Now to solve for the displacement, we use the formula. Displacement is equal to the square root of the sum of the squares of the x and y distances. We should arrive at 7 meters. That's how far Sam is from his starting point. Or, an alternative solution is to simply plot Sam's movement visually or graphically, as shown. This validates our answer earlier, which is a displacement of 7 meters. Question number 9. Find the next figure in the sequence. The correct answer is E. The line moves three steps, example, corner to side to corner, in a counterclockwise direction. On the other hand, the square moves one step, that is, third quadrant to second quadrant to first quadrant, in a clockwise direction. The next figure should have a diagonal line and a square in the lower right corner. Question number 10. Which word does not have a similar meaning to the word ebullient? A. Dictated. B. Brash. C. Fusive. D. Morose. E. Vivacious. The correct answer is D. Morose. The word ebullient means cheerful and full of energy. It is somewhat related in a similar way with all the choices except morose, which is its exact opposite. You have just completed Estet Reviewer number 1, which featured questions for the Estet Mental Ability subtest. If you wish to watch more Estet Reviewers for the Estet Mental Ability subtest, Check out our Astet Mental Ability Reviewers playlist. Check out also our other Astet playlists for other reviewer topics. If you haven't done so yet, 
Please don't forget to subscribe to Review Central and click or press the bell button to make sure you get notified whenever we post a new reviewer or other review materials on this channel. Please like if you find this video useful and feel free to share it to anyone who may also benefit from it. We wish you all the best on your forthcoming estate and we look forward to your exciting days as a Tamasian. Go a stay.